Women in Nation Building Africa are promoting digital literacy and financial inclusion for women in the continent. At the second edition of its Education First series, participants acknowledge that women entrepreneurship is a significant indicator of national development. Ifunaya Eze has the report. As the world grapples with growing inequality and stagnant economies, women in Nation Building Africa are pushing for women to break limiting barriers. This conference has therefore intensified the conversation about reducing the gender gap in digital financial inclusion. According to them, more needs to be done to enable women to take responsibility for the transformation they desire. What today's event is meant to achieve is to bring together women, corporates from all walks of life, to engage on some burning topics because you agree with me that not every woman will ever be in the four walls of a classroom in life. So we use this platform to bridge that gap. So women should be informed whether they've been to the university or not. They should be informed. Can you do it? Are you telling yourself that you can do it? You can achieve it? That is the first thing. You, once you have told yourself inside that you can do it, then no matter the barriers that you encounter on the outside, they cannot, th those barriers cannot influence you otherwise. We need to rise above gender stereotyping. We need to rise above any barriers that hinder us as women. Consequently, they are said they must equip themselves with the knowledge necessary to overcome the barriers hindering their growth in order to develop the qualities required for success. I think take home message is for women to continue to ask questions for financial inclusion, uh, digital literacy and digital inclusion. And of course, uh, for women to understand that they are the actor of their own fortune and they can determine their successes, happiness and achievement. There's so many opportunities out there and do not let cultural bias, challenges, any of any anything that society has said be a barrier to you. The Communications Commission, the NCC, has put in place a lot of support to ensure that not only are there programs that actually help women come into the digital space, but we have also put the broadband connectivity, the mobile connectivity, and a lot of businesses are actually done using the internet or using your phone. So the opportunities are there. It was generally emphasized that a mindset shift is required to drive transformational change. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News, Lagos.